Welcome to XAR Template Tutorial Lesson 120 for the XAR Web Designer 9 Premium Software. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you a new feature in XAR Web Designer 9 Premium that allows you to add a shadow to text and have that text remain as readable text by the search engines. In the past, if you have version 8 Premium, you notice that if you added a shadow to your text, that the program would convert it into an image. But in the new version, version 9 premium, you'll be able to add a shadow to your text and still have that text searchable by the search engines, which will help with your search engine optimization. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing that you want to do is open up a blank new document in XR Web Designer 9 premium. And once you do that, let's go ahead and go to our text uh, option in our toolbar and let's create some text. And I'm going to write this is some shadow text. Okay. And then after we do that, let's go ahead and select the shadow tool in our toolbar. And let's go ahead and left click and drag on this text to add our shadow. And if you look at the top of your info bar, you can adjust some of the settings such as transparency level and also the blur. And you would adjust that however you want it to look. In this case, I'm going to actually add a rectangle behind my text. So let's go to the quick shape for a rectangle and let's draw a rectangle for that and I'm going to go to arrange and then I'm going to select move backwards and it'll put that rectangle behind the text and the reason that I did that is because I'm going to change the color of this text so I'm going to select the selection tool and then on my color editor bar here at the bottom of our screen I'm going to select a different field color oops I actually have the wrong object selected make sure you have your text selected and then change your field color if you want to but in this case, this is the way that I want my uh, shadow text to look on top of this rectangle. So once you have that set how you want it to look, let's go ahead and go to File, Preview Web Page. And then it's saying that, hey, you're using one of the Google fonts. In this case, I'm using the Allen font. And you can just ignore that if you're using the Google font. And hit OK. And I'm going to expand this up some. And you can see that if I put my cursor on this and try to select this text, that is selectable, which means that it's readable by the search engines. But let's take a look at what this looks like in our web browser as well, just to clarify that it will remain as selectable text. And as you can see, if I select this with my cursor, it indeed selects the text. So it will be searchable by the search engines. So that's how you create shadow text in version 9 premium that will be readable by the search engines. And if this video was helpful, don't forget to embed, comment, share, subscribe, and stay tuned for future tutorials. Have a great day.